city. I don't, nobody can't pay me amount of money to get me to put on a different color jersey. Well, I, I, and I don't think they'd want you to leave. leave. You know, your leadership stretched far beyond your It warms your my heart when I get home and say, wow, he got it. He's changing. And you see him changing, right? And you see the evolve of a young man turning into a man because he's asking for advice. Question for the fans of Baltimore. They've seen their offense shrink a bit. They're not working the ball down the field like they were. And now comes a guy that can not only throw it, but do this. Yep. And as a defensive coach, this is what you worry about. You can do everything right, have the coverage perfect, and it's a first down, 10-yard game running the football. Well, what you'll see, Tony, I think is during the course of the year, teams will refuse to play man, man coverage. coverage. Because, yeah. guys, you can't turn your back and go chase a wide receiver because this quarterback going to come running right behind you. And people at Louisville. He is someone who sits in the pocket and wants to read the defenses, often will come off to a second or third look, but that X factor of his ability to run is going to make him so dangerous in this league. It really is. That time he tried to hit the other number one draft choice or first rounder and Hurst incomplete. So he was the last pick in the first round, won the Heisman as as a 19 year old he's still only 21 years old went back to play one more year at Louisville and probably the future meanwhile there's RG3 do they keep three quarterbacks that's the question we don't know third down and ten but Jackson getting his feet wet tonight here in Canton and he fires and that will be caught and that's going to be a first down and taken to the 11 yard line by Jordan. he looks to find his receiver and he continues to do that. He's going to give people headaches. Well, we saw RG3 when he was in the game. A lot of times they're not moving to run. They're moving to protect. Well, unless nobody's going to rush six. So now you've got somewhere to go for this guy on almost every play. It's not a Kansas game. It was Baker Mayfield now, of course, with Cleveland, who won it last year. What did Lamar Jackson tell us if we were asking which one was better draft day or went in the Heisman he said oh by far draft day I didn't have to give a speech second and 13 fires over the middle and that is incomplete intended for Hayden Hurst but another flag it. comes in at the that end that was actually a well thrown ball exactly where you want it you want it for these tight ends up on Personal those team foul. routes I didn't say roughness number 46 defense half the distance of the goal First down. That was Nick Orr. He made contact first. Looked like his head was up a bit, though. Meanwhile, he's going to wind up hitting Hurst here for a touchdown. What an impressive start there for Lamar Jackson. And this is what you want to see, Chris, as you said. So Jackson now. Jackson 2 of 3 for 21, throwing. Bends off the rush. Throws against the grain, deep downfield, but way out of bounds. Second and ten. Well, we've talked a little bit about Lamar Jackson already, but some of these numbers are almost startling by the time you get through these. Design rushing yards over 3,500. And look at this, Tony. Before contact, 5.3 yards. After contact, 3.5 yards. Amazing. Total 8.8. .8 and 79 missed tackles. Now they haven't incorporated any of the RPO stuff, any of the design stuff. He's just out here playing football tonight. And, and he can't gets, have those. Yep, he gets picked off. And that ball hung a little too far inside there, right, Tony? You gotta exactly. get that one out. That is accuracy, and he needed to throw that a little over the outside. All right, back to Jackson now, Lamar Jackson at the helm from the 16 yard line after the turnover, swings one to the outside for a very short game. They leave makes uh, the catch and the tackle was made early on. What about calling plays, Tony? This is one of the things, obviously, that Jackson is going to have to learn in a hurry. Right. We don't think too much of it. We think it comes natural. But so many of these young quarterbacks coming out of that college system did not call the plays. They looked to the sideline. They saw Tom Brady's in the world are doing at the line of scrimmage. Here's the blitz, and he got away for a moment, but they're not and they're filling it in with the blitz here so they come here and come here and then get the free runner and you know that these defensive coordinators are just going to fill those lanes or, or spy or do something the played against that guy that's a good nickname well jackson fires a strike for a first down what we have seen that lamar jackson is capable of just this little flick this is all he needs 
just get it to the guys. He reads defense as well. He can anticipate throws. Sometimes he can get in trouble trying to overthrow the ball. Just get it there. Yeah. You're not going to add. There's still 15 yards of separation. Everybody's running back, and you're still getting that 15 yard collision. And I think the one concept out of the gun. Steps up, slings one a little high and incomplete. Well, let's take a look at Lamar Jackson's night thus far. Let's take a look at that release. Not too bad. Maybe a tad low. Check out the release time. Seven, not terrible. The best of the best in the NFL will be down around 0.3 seconds. And after the punt, up by seven. Uh -oh. And Jackson's going to keep it. He's got a lot of room here. I'm going to turn it into a nine yard gain. Tony, his your dad take. Presenting him at 86 years old and what a thrill it's going to be for his dad. Th that goes for a lot of people uh, around you. And that's what I think Terrell if is. If you missing. deprive yourself of the moment. And I'll tell you, being in it, that is not the thing that you're going to remember. The thing first that could happen to them is to allow Lamar Jackson to sit and watch for a while. How long that takes, whether or not he ever takes over for Joe Flacco, you know, who knows? But I would say as of today, not much of a quarterback controversy. Oh, John Harbaugh was pretty explicit about that. He's Jackson will keep it himself. Get wrapped up at the 30. Be third down, they take another timeout. Well, Tom Benson, this used to be known as Fawcett State.